Member Statements, the member for Oshawa. Thank you, Speaker. People care about their health, and they clearly understand the importance of optometric eye care and are not willing to allow this government to play games with people's sight and eye health. My office is hearing from folks on ODSP, like Arnaldo, who says, quote, I'm diabetic. I need my eyes checked every year. I got to get it every year. I'm due for my glasses. I missed a year because of the pandemic, so what are we going to do about that? Seniors and diabetics and young people need glasses. The $39 million is a slap in the face. I'm stuck between a rock and a hard place, end quote. We're hearing from parents like Leanna, who wrote, quote, I'm writing to you today as a parent of two daughters in Oshawa, one who currently wears glasses and contact lenses, and one who this week has mentioned to me that she's having a difficult time reading the whiteboard at school. I have done what any parent would do in this case. I phoned my optometrist to make an appointment. My eldest needs new contact lenses, and my youngest likely now needs corrective lenses. To my horror, I learned that not only is OHIP not covering our exams, but I can't even choose to pay to have my daughter's vision checked. I'm left with one daughter who now cannot get contact lenses because her prescription is more than a year old, and another who can't effectively learn because she is unable to see properly and no options to resolve this for my kids." End quote. Speaker, I've written to this Minister of Health about the many calls and letters from Oshawa seniors, folks, and families who cannot access the eye care they deserve. I will continue to present petitions and advocate for this government to return to the negotiating table and restore OHIP-insured eye care services to all youth and seniors. Despite the challenges for many to accessing eye care in, in Ontario, everyone can see plainly that the government's unwilling to fairly fund optometric eye care. So do the right thing, Premier, and save eye care in Ontario. Thank you.